with Sasa and then today I'm going to show you how to make these awesome pants. Um, they're inspired by, from XOK and XOM, the history uh, music video. And they have, a lot of them have like these kind of low hanging crotch pants with these like yarn on it. When I first saw them, I'm like, oh, the yarn thing is really cool, or like the string that they had. I'm like, oh, it's going to take forever doing one piece by once. But I figured out, like I thought about it more. And I, so when I use interfacing and fuse it, it'll be much faster. I'll show you how to do that. And so then there's side pockets. I love doing this with these contents. To make the trim, we get the yarn and you just want to line it up. And after you figure out your length, you just snip. Snip. Okay, then you cut your long pieces of uh, interfacing. This is how you're going to fuse it on because if you try and sew on each individual thing, you'll take forever. So, of course, you'd want to try a sample one first just to make sure like, it works. See, look, it's st it sticks good enough so that by the time you sew it, it will stay together. So I have this piece already, now we're going to join it up. Afterwards, you want to gently peel this up. There you go, and then you have this nice trim. You want to cut out four pieces like this. Um, and then here I've already sewn on one of the, uh, the um, fluffy trim. So here's the uh, another piece. We're just going to place this down here. Pin this and then we're going to zigzag this, just a light basting just to keep this in place. Afterwards we'll do the pockets first. You need to put the trim on. For the pockets, so i cut the pockets out. Take right sides together. The pockets can be kind of confusing, but it's really quite simple. So we sewed both pockets on to each other side. Now flip the pockets inside, you know, inside like this. Flip this over. So you want the right sides together. Make sure the trim is in the way. You line up the pockets like this. And now all you do is just sew around. And that's it. And then the pocket will be inside. So if you open it out like this, and that will be all sewed in, then the pocket will be After you finish with the whole trim on the leg and the pockets, right, then you want to sew in the inner seam, which I've already done, and then attach the two legs together, which is the big crotch here. Afterwards, now what I'm going to do, I'm going to gather the waist, and then we're going to serge the elastic on, and then finish the, the hem, and then we'll be finished. Oh, here's the finished pants. Okay, so I hope you learned something and you had fun and enjoyed what I made or want to make it yourself. It was so fun. Uh, so thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.